talk about uh, how you feel about tomorrow's game and what you feel uh, we need to do to, to get the win. Well, uh, you know, UTSA is, is, is going to be a lot better this year than last year simply because they're bringing Jerome Hill back. Uh, he was injured last year and sat out most of the year. And uh, with him back on the floor, I believe that UTSA is going to be a, a, have a better program uh, this year and, and going to uh, have more success than they did last year. And they've also brought in a, you know, a couple of other players that uh, uh, are very good offensive players. So I do think you're seeing a more potent offensive team this year at, uh, at, for UTSA than they did in years past. We have to stop their fast break and, and uh, make sure they don't get easy transition buckets on us. That's one thing. Secondly, Hill and Keon Lewis, if I remember his name correctly, are, are both very good players. Ryan Bowie's a great shooter. And, uh, you know, they, uh, like I said, they, they just do have some offensive weapons. We have to find a way to uh, stop them, uh, those three in particular. Uh, I think also we have to do a better job of taking care of the basketball. And, uh, you know, obviously playing defense the way we did the second half against Seattle and the first half against uh, Lamar. I, I'd love to see what this team would can do if we can put two halves together. I think, you know, we would be a very good basketball team, defensively speaking. And uh, how important, I know that, you know, you, this will be your first Texas State UTSA game. You obviously have coached against UTSA in the past. How important do you think that the rivalry is to get renewed and, and for fans to really be able to sink their teeth into these games? Well, I think, I think, I think this, a, a, every school needs rivalries, and they need rivalries that, that in which the schools are not located very far apart. Even though we're not in the same league, I do believe you can set up something with UTSA where every fall, both in football and basketball, you could have an exciting event for the, for the people of Central Texas, UTSA, Texas. I think uh, my old school, Stephen F. Austin and Sam Houston, do the Battle of the Piney Woods in Houston, and they usually draw a pretty good crowd. And I do think something like that could happen for both basketball and football for UTSA. So. Uh, I, I, I'm, I like that we have UTSA scheduled. It's, it's, it's not much travel for us or them. And I do think it's going to be an interesting matchup that will draw media attention and, and, and fans alike.